Hey, fella. I got all my quarters tangled up here. I'm alright. Just had dinner, figured I'd play a little, little World of Final Fantasy tonight. Oh no. I'm on my uh, second account, so I've never played the game before on this account. So there were no save files to turn on automatic cross. So I don't play on PS3. World of Final Fantasy. Uh, uh, always fast. Uh, I mean, uh, bell speed fast. How about now? Is that mic better now? Music volume, we want down here a little. That's good. I need a need a better setup. Whenever I get an, another job, I have to get a real mic for stream. Ah, uh, yeah, I think I stepped on it the other day. That might be what happened, cause it sits next to the, my game on the floor. Uh, just sending out a tweet that I'm live, and then I will be ready to go here. Yeah, okay, let's do this. World of Final Fantasy. Thank you, Vela. Oh my god, all the things I have already. <laughs> it's all the stuff I down or the DLCs I had on my other Prologue. name came onto Away this name. At last. Oh, you don't want me as a mod fellow. I ban everybody that talks shit. I don't even give them a chance. <laughs> Oh no, you woke up with a robotic arm. It's uh it's Final Fantasy in chibi form.
You'll see what the hand is for in a little bit. Basically, this game is combining Final Fantasy with Pokemon. I actually don't remember him waking up there. I thought he woke up in his bed. What country were you again, Belu? Sweden? Hey, this is the part I remember he wakes up in the bed. Nice. Ah, so you're an hour between the English guys and the Finnish guys. Oh no. I, did, I counted that wrong, I think. 2 a.m. Oh, you're the same time as Sweden. Or, uh, Bella. Huh? Oh, right. I gotta get to work. He's gotta get to work, and he's got something sitting on his head. Oh, am I gonna make it? The boss hates when I'm late. Uh, sir, y you have a little bad head there. Just a little bad head. You know, it's no big deal. And again, it's not like business has picked up any. Bad head. <sighs> the streets sure are quiet today. Nine bean coffee. Hey, I'm here. He's got a customer, even though they weren't open. How'd she get in if no one's here yet? Good morning. I'm real sorry. I hope you haven't been waiting long. Huh? Mm. Oh, right. She needs some water. Oh, no thanks. A pint. I mean, a cup of coffee, please. Oh. And bring the whole jar of sugar. I'm gonna need it. Right. That's one cup of joe. And I'll get you one of the big jars. <sighs> Has nobody made the coffee yet? <sighs> Come on. Get it together, guys. I'm sorry, miss. This might take a while. Hey, no hurry. Time's not an issue. <laughs> uh... I believe it came off for PS3 and PS4 at the same time because there's the cross save option. Here you go. I look at the Starbucks logo. <laughs> Thank you. Sure. Oh, I don't even put that much sugar in my coffee. There you are! Come on! Keep it down, Rain. How about acting your age, huh? Hey, don't talk down to me. Listen, last time I checked, little bro, I've been around a few minutes longer than you. <sighs> okay, okay. I get it already. Very sorry. And apparently they're twins. <sighs> so, what's up? I'm all ears. Well, you don't have to get all sarcastic. Uh, you really are all ears. Uh, what? 
forget it. So long. Have you seen anybody this morning? Oh, yeah, all, all the twins do that. Whoever was born first always brags that they're older. Customer. What? Ah! Oh, hello. You didn't even see her, dude. Uh, yeah, but. Ah, uh, look, come with me right now. Easy. There's nobody here. So it's a quiet morning. Maybe they just I mean no one. Huh? Lon. Have you bumped into anyone today besides her? Oh yeah. Uh now that you mention it, I guess not. And this isn't setting off any alarms? Well, should it? You two really don't remember a thing. Huh? What was that? Who are you? If you're from around town, then I don't know you. Uh Rain Manners. You two really don't remember a thing. Would you please just answer my question? You can call me Anna Crow. Anna Crow will work. Anna Crow. Okay, well, we woke up to a ghost town this morning. Maybe you know why? Yes, you're quite alone. But you always have been. Huh? This world, it's always been the two of you. A world without time. One that ended when it began. What? That's the weirdest thing I've heard. But don't worry. Just because the world ended doesn't mean that it's going anywhere. You know, I have been checking up on you two. Until now, you were nothing but blank stares. So imagine my surprise when Lon took my order. What a morning. Okay. Now you're kind of scaring me. <laughs> So, now that yeah, you're awake, right there, we've got a story to tell. Which yeah, brings us their, to their arms Donna, catch monsters. Uh, who the hog put this thing on my head? Yeah, I did try to mention it before. You take it from here. I'll go on ahead and link up a path. You the daddy! Huh? What? Hey, uh, hey! You hey, can't just uh, leave! Uh, Salutations! The name is Tama, and I'm here to help out. Does anyone have any questions? Huh. Wait, I've got tons of questions. Why were you sitting on my head? And how the hell can a fox even talk? That's the seriously the first thing on your mind? <sighs> now I just see why in a crow is just about the ready to throw in the towel. We're not allowed to be confused? Uh, hey, whoa, <sighs> take it easy there, Lon. I thought you were upset too. Let's start the over. I'll make us some of the coffee. Huh? Oh, yes, please. <sighs> but I already made some coffee. Yeah, it's kind of got the here. same animations as you, Gil. Just roll with this rain. Chill the owls. You live the much longer. Yeah, Lon. You shouldn't start out your morning with so much stress. <laughs> oh, would you the like some sugar? Three cubes for you, right, Lon? Huh? I'm good uh, with just one. No. Okay, I... I'll the go and put the coffee on. But I just said I. You know what? Just give me my dang cup of coffee. Barrage keepers? Me and Rain? That's the correct! Those marks on your arms are proof. You were born to work the miracles! Miracles? Our arms can do that? Dude. How could you the forget? You used to command a whole legion of them! You were masters of them! Powerful living illusions known as mirages! In the fact, even the Pleiad answered to you and those are the seven strongest mirages of all! With their power, you could have the ruled over all the world! Oh... So... We could have ruled the world? Because... What, we controlled these mirages? Well, that's what I've heard. From who? What do you mean? In a crow that told me, of course. But enough the 
reminiscing. I've got to teach you two to use mirages again. What? How's that? <laughs> First off, I'm going to present you with my very own prismarium. So what does it do? With this prismarium, the mirage inside becomes yours. And you can make it do the anything and the everything you command. So let's the try it right now in glorious combat. Hey, cat. Wait. Thanks what? for stopping by. Huh? Oh, shit. trying to do so make for sure you use them wisely <laughs> I, I forgot dark made that uh, command uh, yeah and fuck's sake. Can we keep it in basic? That would be lovely. I even knew that you had talent. <laughs> sleep, sleep well, cat. We'll see you in the morning. Seriously? Dude, but seriously. It's hard to believe. I'm sure it is. As far as I can tell, you two have lost everything. All the memories and experience you've ever accumulated. Oh, but wait. Of course that would have happened when you and this world were spliced out. Huh? So not only did they lose the mirages they had, they've been the stripped of all their memories of the mirages too? But... I guess that explains why all their other memories seem to be largely on the affected. What? Listen, let me show you something. Oh no. Hey, Aaron. What's up, buddy? Ooh. There, just beyond this light, shiny lies door. Another world called Grimoire. That is where you'll find all the mirages you've lost. You mean they're all inside this gate? You got it. Are you ready to conquer them again? So, um, if we do manage to find all the lost I'm, I'm alright. Just ate dinner a little while ago. We'll be able to or I stream a little bit. We forgot? Until well, my friend streams. That. After all, you lost your memories. It's not the same thing as forgetting them. Oh. But, even if you don't remember Grimoire, Grimoire still knows a lot about you. 
You're certain to find traces and records of your past. Okay, so like... You're saying whether we remember anything about ourselves or not, we can still find clues about our past and the things we've done? Correct. And if you keep on gathering mirages, I think you might even meet your family in due time. Uh, our family? Huh? Well, hey, Protego. How you it doing? It makes sense that we'd have parents. Oh, yes. So then, you going? I'm you doing going? pretty good. Will you journey to How Grimlock? you doing? <sighs> so, you're not commentating on tomorrow, Air? Oh, okay. Gotcha. Trophy? I haven't done anything yet, and I got a trophy. No, don't overwrite it. Thank you. Any exciting plans for the weekend, Protego? Alright, sounds good, Aaron. I'll be public enemy number one in here. Alright. Chapter 1 Land of the Lilikin. <laughs> the Lilikin. Let's see, midday for you would be when I'm waking up. <laughs> so, this must be Grimoire. What? <laughs> what? You look like such a little dweeb. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, <laughs> I know, we look ridiculous. <laughs> I'm sure that's how every the body in this world must look. And a crow just wanted to make sure you had a nice and a handy way of blending in. <laughs> wow, she can do stuff like that? That is awesomely weird. Well, this kind of works out. We won't have anybody gawking at our arms. Way to find the silver lining. Uh, I didn't know they were making a spiral remastered, but I will definitely get that if I have a job again at that point. All right, to change rain is L1, circle, line is L1 square. Little Big Planet? Never played that one. Even when it was free on PS3, when they had the hacking thing, I didn't play it. <laughs> Tip ya. I guess we should head straight down this path. It's the only direction we can go. Think you can manage to not get lost? Um, you know, just this once. What? I How will I not get be lost? getting Battlefield 5. Yet? I don't play many shooters, just Destiny and uh Borderlands are the only shooters I really play. I'm not into the whole PVP thingy. Alright, I want battle mode, wait, no, what's the one I'm looking for? Battle menu, classic. There we go. Oh, hello, I spy another mirage. That is the call to Choco Chip. What are you <coughs> waiting for? Go on and imprison the it. Okay. Sort of like a prismarium. What is it? That's the call to prism. Use it to the make the choco chicks prismarium. Every time you find a new the mirage you haven't seen before, it'll be recorded what do you mean, Bella? in the crow's special mirage manual. Whoa! Does it even have pictures? You the betcha. And then whenever you add a new mirage to the manual, you receive one of its prisms. But only the first time, mind you. Okay, first try the weakening the choco chick, then the use your prism. 
You mean you're actually gonna let me do something? Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Basic Pokemon. Fire, ice, thunder, wind, water, earth, light, dark. Holy shit. Ah. Oh, 90% of my viewers are American. Because it was before I met you guys. <laughs> so... Weak to ice and dark. Oh, yeah, she has no abilities because she's by herself. Pretty much. You, you collect the monsters, you put the smaller ones on your head, you stand on top of bigger ones. Well, that ought to do it. Predictable. Oh wow, he did eight hour stream, nice. Using the eggshell as a little helmet. Name my Mirage. Ha! <laughs> we'll name it Bad Boy. <laughs> He's the little chicken. That's what he gets for hitting the pit road wall the other day. <laughs> cool! I can see the Choco Chick running around in the Prismarium. Pretty the neat, huh? Next, why the don't you have a go at stacking that Choco Chick on your head? Here, watch, I'll just show you. I hate tutorials. Oh, now I get it. So when I saw you perched on Lon's head back in Ninewood Hills, that's what you call stacking. Yep, that's the right. While I'm up to here, I get to take it nice and the easy. Uh, is that stacking or slacking? When you create a stack, the HP of everyone in the stack gets the added together. Like they say, strength in the numbers. Oh, so it's like combining into a super robot. Better than yet, your magic <laughs> and other abilities have the potential to change too. It all depends on how your stack is the configured. Huh? Oh, I don't need any action figures when I get to blast out super attacks like a super robot. Well, just be the careful. Stacking doesn't then make you invincible. Some of the enemy attacks have the power to unstack you. In other words, bye-bye super robot, so to speak. Oh, hell no. Yowzers. The next 24 hour stream is gonna be in. I don't know, September, I think. But look on the bright side. If I decide to do another one. The story in this game? Ooh. I'd have to let you know tomorrow. I have a save file on my other uh, PSN. I think I was like 70 hours into it. Uh. Yeah, when when you're the big person, you can put a medium one on top of you and then a small one on top of that. When you're small, you're considered the medium, so you can stand on top of a large and have a small on top of you. Alright. By the way, you two can just switch. Alright, so stack set up.
Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'll, I'll leave it in uh, RJ's Discord there. Yeah, it's somewhere between 60 and 70 hours. Abilates. Libra and Foxfire. <sighs> Depending on your Shit. size, you can make different stacks. You won't be allowed to put big things on top of the small things when creating a stack. So, to get on top of a mirage, you need to the be in Lilican form. The best way to the <laughs> learn is to try it once you've rounded up a few more mirages. I don't think people would understand you if you did. Geometry dash for fuck's sake, man. I'd rage quit on that game after 20 minutes. Huh? A dead end? But there's nowhere else to go. What are we gonna do? Never the fear! Look the closely! This may appear to the be a wall, but it's actually eh, it's a okay, human boop. Form. Is this a mirage too? Not in the traditional the sense of the word. But you'll see these pests all over Grimoire. And unless you they give them what they want, they'll give you a hard the time and block the way. So what is it they want? It really the depends on the gimme golem. So the first thing you'll have to the do is examine it. Can you just let me know when you get it all settled? Because I know you want to play that game. If they ever give it to you at some point today. <laughs> I just saw the Discord that you can't pick it up till Monday at the post office. And I think Best Buy should give you something for that since it's supposed to be there today. Gimme, gimme! Gimme, gimme! A luster leaf. So where do we find that? That choco oh, Jesus, boop. ought to be able to track the down what we need. But first things the first. Are you gonna... We're going to have to unlock the right ability on the Choco Chicks the Mirage board. <laughs> yes. Give Boop the game. For the love of God. I know how to play the game. Ah. See, I got an emote for that too. Uh, stroll on Choco Chicks Mirage Board. Okay. Doopity doopity doo. Stroll. Land stroll. Yeah, that emo is actually my old logo before I got the current CT logo. All right, so now you have stroll. You can walk on the outside here with us. Hey, the choco chicks come along for a stroll. Huh? It found. Yay! You the found it. Now try examining. Gimme, gimme. Give me. Golem one more at a time. Huh? It found. Gimme, gimme. Whoa, it vanished. That's so cool. I guess the Choco Chick found us just the item we needed. Yep, yep. With the help of a Mirage <laughs> of the two, there's nothing that you can't accomplish. Oh, my, my Twitter the is uh, are for much the more than unlocking abilities. The same. You can also use them to change your Mirages into new and the powerful forms. So be sure to keep on the leveling up and working on your mirage boards. Wait, and the link doesn't you'll work. Be bouncing and the trouncing across Grimmore like huh. a pair of the pros. Huh? I found something. I'll readjust it later. Do, 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 do.
Wait. There you So, Tama, I notice mirages disappear when we defeat them. Why is that? Most of the mirages you see in Grimoire don't actually the technically... Yep. <laughs> see... Wait, you've been to Connecticut? Of, of all the states in the United States, you've been to Connecticut. How many hours in? Uh, I started the stream when you got here, Viva. They can't maintain their presence here anymore. They fizzled the out and go back to their own worlds. Huh. Ah. Wait. Now, that's weird. Who was it that told me all this before? Ugh. It's like right there on the tip of my tongue. Gotcha. Now what's this? This is the called a Mercury. I'm sure he's a lot happier up there because living here is sucks. Are, Mirages. Say? Oh man, let's go catch him. This one's yeah. not very cute. Uh, Yale's okay, I guess. But it's also in one of the highest crime cities. <laughs> now what do we do? I tried to the tell you. Inside Mercris, you're likely to find mirages that are the strong and dangerous. You tried to the tell us. Oh Try yeah. Harder, please. You know, it's funny you say that, Boop. I get an email every day from Wings Over that gives me a coupon for a free milkshake from them. I don't know why... I Good job, Lon. You, you killed everybody. Douchebag. Okay. Hey, Zen. Nothing much. What's up with you, man? My buddy actually owns a wing place. They put it on the campus over here oh, ne no. next to me. Did you two die already? What? I died? But that's no way. Maybe it's true. That mirage in the Murkriff did kinda Well, I'm still alive. Yes. That's because someone intervened. Right at the moment of your demise. And made it so the battle never happened. Wow, you can really do that? Of course. Although Tom is the one who does it. That's the right! I have the power to rewind time a little, and then the whisk you to safety. Although, it the cost me a life. Alright, Velu, sleep all, man. So I hope you don't mind if I rest for a little the while afterwards. I got my uh, PSGL race tomorrow, so I'll it, be on there. I've actually got multiple lives. Back there, I had to sacrifice one of those lives to turn back time and to save you. You see, this girl with the ribbon that showed up in my dreams, she's the one who taught me how to do it. That makes zero sense and kind of freaks me out, but Tama, I'm impressed. But thanks! Oh, but just so you know, I can only use my powers to protect the two of you. And yet, Connecticut does have a lot of trees because fight, when it's like uh, fall time here, they all turn color, so it's nice. And I can always recover my lives if you stay here and let me the rest a spell. So, don't forget to give me a breather <laughs> before I run out of second the chances. Dude, you got it. Say no more. Rest yourself, silk. Yes, this, sir. Thanks, Tama. We really owe you one, especially Lon. Yeah, it's Tama. Have the good sense to listen before dying. Um. Yeah, uh, <laughs> I'll let you know, Velu. Hey, I'll probably be a raging. that? Oh, if you mean our new guest, she claims to have gotten herself lost. Go say hello. She's quite the character. Uh, okay. The real question is how she got here from the outside world when it's no easy trick. 
She must have experience crossing between planes. All right, so I know we were talking in your Discord earlier about Final Fantasy 13. So she's over at North Promenade. Here's the first character from Final Fantasy 13. Oh, wow. She's so tiny. Is she a... Uh, what's the word again? Lilikin? Chocobo Golina! Oh! <coughs> Hello, and how are you? <laughs> Sweet Zentama. <laughs> uh, good. More or less. You know, what a nice, quiet place. Oh, uh... So who are the you? Oh, you can call me Chocolate! I seem to have washed up here like a soggy yellow feather in a storm. Huh? I do have this funny knack for winding up in strange places. Uh, Chocobolina. Cool. <laughs> Alright! Care to shop? I've got the goods. Chocoboku Ching! <laughs> uh. There you go, that would get all the views. <laughs> um, let's see, I have three potions. How much money I got? Eh. We'll buy one potion. Oh wait, no, we won't buy a potion. I was looking at the sell price. Whoa, slow down. What kind of operation is this? It's called a shop, dear. You're in luck! I find all kinds of stuff as I bounce from point A to point Q. I'm your Choco <laughs> connection! Whee! So hey, are you ready to head back to Grimoire? I mean, you can make it into a dress. Well, I don't remember you the raising me at all! Who's this? Oh, hi. I'm just your adorable local wind pixie, a.k.a. Seraphie. My hobbies include... She sounds so excited. Income. Let's see. Oh, I'm good at hoarding things. She kind of looks like a cupcake. Hoarding? Hoarding? Why do you think I'm here? You must have tons of prismariums. More than you can handle, right? Well... We're still working on it. Uh-huh. You'll have scads of them before long. You're gonna need a place to unload. Yeah, they are kind of bulky. Well, who's got you covered? This pixie right here. Anacro made me a special prism case that lets me keep all your prismariums safe. Just plonk the ones you don't need in and you ink the ones you don't Her hair need reminds me of the girl from Scott Pilgrim, the drummer girl. Nine Wood Hills are from an alternate location with a suitably strong connection. Additional terms, conditions, and restrictions may apply. Okay. <laughs> I'm not sure I caught every single word, but I guess I agree. <laughs> oh, yeah. This prismarian belongs to one of my tribe. Treat it with the same boundless love and affection you feel for me. Okay. Seraphie's kind of a special the case. And I believe she's supposed to be a dog, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, she sits here in the town and every so often she'll have an item on top of her head she'll give to you. A Seraphone. Or Seraphie.
Let's name this one. Gritsuko. Let me write the name of that down. I'm wondering why my back air was lit up just now. Oh, um, yeah, let me write that down now. Take a look. Damn here. After five days, return. Okay. Apparently, I have soccer tickets. Yeah, the server phone's good for one thing, and uh, it, I believe they cost three thousand dollars to buy a new one when you run out. and I will look it up. What should we name Sylph? She kind of looks like a cupcake, too. I'm gonna go with Sylvia. That's as close to Sylph. Oh, nice. Yeah, my Netflix just auto-renewed the other day, even though I had no money in my account, but it auto-renewed. <laughs> Here we got something on our head. <sighs> anyway, I think you should be able to manage on your own from here. You mean you're the leaving us? Yes. You handle things now. Oh, okay. I the will. It's cool. <clears throat> I'll lock this place down <clears throat> tighter than a Malboro's bottle of mouthwash. That's a Seraphy guarantee. Huh? Huh? Down. But, she but where are you going now? Me. Oh, well. Somewhere what else, of course. Mean? Yeah, that's huh? not exactly very helpful. Awesome. Look, we really need to ask <laughs> you so They're many fighting things. in the background. No, no, you'll figure it out. I can't do everything for you now. Everything? <laughs> But you've barely done anything. Besides, every world has its own rules. Like water dousing fire, and light banishing darkness. Uh, I think that's just called science? Well, I designed mine to be so completely unbreakable that even I can't undo them. Undo what? The rules. <sighs> You're bad at explaining. You're saying you can't help, because that violates the rules of the world or something? Exactly. But why is that? I mean, come on. Just who do you think you are? Me? <laughs> oh, well... I'm God. <laughs> See, I was gonna say that, but I didn't know if that, that came now or later in the story. Yeah. She's gone. She's the goddess of the world. Dude. Uh, I guess we can't necessarily rule it out, but for somebody calling the cosmic shots... She seems kind of sub-benevolent. Well, that's an crow for you, so get used to it. So, she really is God? Beats me. Anna crow is Anna crow, wouldn't you say? Pretty the much. Uh, thanks for clearing that's that. That's why she had to make up a name when they asked who she was at the beginning. <laughs> Just give me two seconds, I gotta grab my Gatorade. I've like done nothing, and I've already saved the game three times in 46 minutes. Damn it, game. 
Oh look, let's save again. <laughs> Actually, that should be my title next time I stream the game. <laughs> certainly cost us a chunk of time. And whose fault is that? Oh, uh, yeah, I want names. <laughs> that rage streaming star do. Just go to the mines and just hit all the rocks. <laughs> For the love of God. I know how to play the game. <laughs> no. Boop. <laughs> Boop is gonna go up to Pam and just slap her. Stop drinking! <laughs> she <laughs> She's gonna make uh, Sam or, or whoever the hell she married in the game there make him sleep on the couch. <laughs> A moo. I don't know what the fuck a moo is, but kind of looks like a pudgy squirrel kind of thing. It actually looks like a Sentret from Pokemon. We'll name him Sentret. Yeah, that's true. So, some of the camera angles in this game are a little iffy. I guess we're doing this. Come on, bring it! No trouble at all. Victory! Oh, guaranteed. Have you ever seen her come to the bus stop? I swear to God, she comes from the bar, not her house. Yep, Sephiroth music. Oh, water the flowers. Battle themes they have. Normal, Sephiroth. Uh, I guess that guy's from Final Fantasy Twelve. We'll keep it on Sephiroth. Um Yes, uh I have them unlocked as a summon already, but I haven't gotten to the part where they let you use the summons. All right, Lon, don't touch the damn box again. Level 26. Lon, don't touch it this time. I know, I know. But could we see all this stuff before? Now that you've fought that thing the once, you can see all its information. And if you the happen to know some Libra magic, you can peep at its data yep. before you even jump in. Very good thing to keep in the mind. Got it. Yep. Very good thing to keep in the mind, Lon. Uh, why are you repeating it? And just for my sake? 
the banter between the brother and sister in this game is classic. Alright. Yeah, there we go. Actually, you know what? Who's first? Oh, it's her. A little foxfire. Wasn't so bad. <laughs> Pretty much. Hey, Sentra. Money is so hard to come by in this game. It comes so slow. Sh should we touch it again? Should we touch it again? Huh? Huh? Oh, okay. Over there. Nothing. Okay. Could you walk straight? No. Oh, oh. Never mind. You get the right robots in this later. Wait. So showing exactly everything we've done up to this point. <laughs> I love this game. Have you guys ever played the Tales of series? Like, Tales of Symphonia, Tales of Berseria. They got really good music in that, those games, too. Mizuki. Of course. Chapter two. Yep. Told by prophecy. Yeah, they're called champions in this game, and they're your summons. They'll they'll attack the monster hey, and they'll sis, give you. Is that a town over there at the end of the bridge? Uh, perks. Yeah, and I don't know why, but something about it takes me back. Just wonder there was a treasure chest off on the side here or something. Maybe not. Yeah, I could totally see you streaming this, Boo. Huh? Huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, 
You think we're supposed to get on? Absolutely! I'll be aboard! Whoa, dude! I don't remember getting on the train. Oh, oh hey sis, let's park it here. Sure. <laughs> Master Vivi. <laughs> uh, uh, hi. Whoa, pluck my needles. I don't know how long it's been since we've had new passengers. Huh? 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 Right, tickets, please. <laughs> uh. oh, a mirage? What? It talks? Oh, I indeedly needly am a mirage. But I'm also the train conductor, so... Tickets, please. The conductor? Alright. If Tama can talk, then why not? But the train tickets that we need are right the here. Right the hell? Wow! Semi-lifetime passes, eh? Haven't feasted my eyes on one of these in a swell spell. Right then. Pleasant journey. He even has the whistle. <laughs> Where did those tickets come from? In the crow made sure I was provided with everything we could ever need. Yep, yep. Okay, then. So why a semi-lifetime pass? And not a lifetime one? <laughs> a swell spell. Oh, I, I have the theme for this game on the PS4, and this song here in the background plays the whole time near the menu. Cornelia. That looks like it would be a jigsaw puzzle. Is there an apple on your head? This place rules. Yeah, it's like something right out of a fantasy. Uh, <laughs> See what you did there. Hey, Tama, why don't you hit your ride? Roger the Dodger. Pardon. Huh? If I may ask, would you be kind enough to tell me what country you hail from? Oh, us? We're uh. <laughs> <laughs> Mirages from the Bahamushin army! <laughs> Bahamu? What's a Bahamu? Well, the Bahamushin Federation has a whole army of mirages in their employ. Huh? Someone's made a whole army out of them? Sounds just fine by me. Line them up nice and neat for us, so we can round them up. Huh? Hey, wait up! Uh, I don't have any feet. All right, you Bahamus. What's your beef, huh? You even make it sound like they're made of beef. <sighs> yeah, Lauren. Don't you know it's at stake? <laughs> Resist. Really? Whoa! What the? What just happened? Why wasn't I able to imprison that mirage? Didn't you see the light that's surrounding it? That means it's the beholden to another keeper. The what? The O? You smell? Uh, no! What I mean is, the Mirage already has another the Master. So until you give their boss the old heave the hoe, you won't be able to claim it for yourself. Oh, fire whoever wrote that little hook in. Lon, it's nay on the fourth wall stuff! 
giants. Oh, whoops. Are they Bahamutian soldiers? But they drove the mirages off for us. It's just like the prophecy, word for word. But which one? Well, we know how it ends. Please, may I speak with you? Huh? Oh, sure. Yeah, in this game there's two prophecies. A good one and a bad one. The two of you. You've traveled here from another world. Oh, well, I wouldn't... I mean... Actually, I think you're pretty much spot on. And we're Mirage Keepers, too. But blood, don't tell her! Why not? Face it, we're too awesome to try and hide it. I'm like, exuding all over. Mon, you don't even know what exude means. There is someone who would like to have a word with you. Could you possibly stop by Castle Cornelia? So let's find this Casa Cornelius place. Doesn't Casa mean up? It's gotta be higher up. The more. Well, you've got the direction correct. Even if the rest of that was completely off the base. That woman must be important if she's inviting us to the castle. What's up, guys? Nice armor. Leave them alone, please. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Welcome to the Kingdom of Cornelia. I am Princess Sarah. Wait, you're like a princess? We had no idea. Oh my gosh. I am so sorry Lon acted like such a royal idiot. I'm not royal. Oh, and I'm his older sister, Rain. It's an honor. Please forgive the ruse. At first I suspected that you might be agents sent here by Bahamut. I was wrong. You stood up bravely against their mirages, and kept our town safe. All of Cornelia thanks you. Oh, I wouldn't say we were that brave. Really. <sighs> Stop, you're so modest. Still, the fact of the matter is, we didn't do anything all that outstanding. Yeah, we're more the in-standing types. For fuck's sake. I'm pretty <laughs> sure that in-standing isn't an actual the word. <laughs> Forgive me. It's just so hard to believe that you two are the stuff of prophecies. Prophecies? Oh, that's right. I think I heard the townsfolk going on about some kind of prophecy too. Oh, I am sorry. If you will permit me, I will explain it from the beginning. Uh, that, that's this whole game. The... You see Cornelia... The brother tries to make a pawn and it just sounds stupid. Midway up Grimoire. Unfederated? Yes. Let me explain that as well. The majority of Grimoire's countries, and municipalities, have annexed themselves to the Bahamutian Federation under the rule of Brandalus, the Herald King. Cornelia, however, has continued to maintain its sovereignty. The Federation has made attempts to erode this stance countless times. But we have held our ground, and now Bahamut has taken to armed provocation. You mean like... That mirage attack before? Yes. So where does this prophecy factor in? The Azure prophecy speaks of a divergence. When time begins its march anew, they shall return as visitors. Giants from the hills of a world not our own. Upon Grimoire, they will wreak two divergent futures. One that brings salvation, and the other ruin. An enigma to confound even the highest mind. The giants may... reek to futures? Reek, huh? <laughs> oh, man! Tama, this prophecy's about you! What? What are you even talking about? There's nothing the relevant the way I smell! You big the dummy! Well, at least I'm dumber than you! <laughs> I'm sorry, your highness. I'm afraid there's just no hope for them. Oh. At least I'm so, dumber than you. The giants from the hills, as in Ninewood Hills, I guess it's one of those believe what you want to things. But yeah, so far it does seem to match up. Um, 
Do you mind if I ask you a slightly awkward question? If this federation is really so terrible, why have so many countries agreed to become members? Most of the mirages in Grimoire, not all, but certainly most of them, are now firmly under the federation's control. With such a powerful army behind them, citizens can go about their lives without fearing the mirages that still roam free. Dude, they control that many mirages? Seriously? Y yes Uh, dude. Whoa. King Grandalus's <laughs> herald lieutenants, known as Siguardus and Pelinor, command all of Grimoire's mirages with the same authority as the famous Queen of the Keepers of ages past. So there was a Queen of the Keepers? Sounds like she was pretty powerful. Yes, but that was more than a century ago. So, sorry for the string of dumb questions, but if the Federation can guarantee that kind of absolute protection, wouldn't it be worthwhile to <laughs> take them up on their offer? It may seem wise, but you see, membership in the Federation involves following their laws and adoption of a heinous creed. It chills me right to the marrow of my bones. That bad? Yes. I beg you, see for yourselves. Once you have done so, well, you will understand. All right, then. Now then, may I ask what the two of you intend to do next? Well, whatever's going on out there, the only thing we can do right now is just keep rounding up more mirages, am I right? Oh? Apparently, at one time we commanded a whole legion of them. But somehow, we lost them along with our memories. So, we're hoping by getting the mirages back, we might stumble on some clues about our past. That's right. So if mirages like those goblins are bugging you, we can lay down the smack. Lay down the what? <laughs> lay the smack uh, down? I think what he's trying to say is we'll help <coughs> you out, or at least in the best way we know how. Oh, wonderful. You have my thanks. Mine and all Cornelia's. Still, if we're going to be any help, don't you think we need to beef up our arsenal first? Because we can't put up much of a fight without some strong mirages. Good point. Princess, do you know of any nearby places where strong mirages live? Certainly. If you travel to the northeast of Cornelia, you'll find the Nether Nebula, a network of caverns inhabited by many wild mirages. Ooh, nice. Well, Not at all. Savage mirages have been sighted <laughs> in the nebula. You may well end up dead. But that's cool. If you insist upon going, then please take the utmost caution. He will, your highness. Otherwise, he's gonna be extremely sorry. Wait a minute, why just me? What did I do? Ah, uh, Jesus. It looks like we'll need to wind our way down to reach the exit. Seems that way. What a funny way to build a town. Oh, it's not that this strange to the people of Grimoire. Hey, while we're here, why don't we ask around town and then see what we can find out? Uh... Oh, say... You wouldn't happen to be the giants from the hills by any chance, would you? You see, there's a situation I'm dealing with where I could really use your assistance, since you must know mirages so well. Could I trouble you to please bring me an earth hammer? If you could, I would be forever in your debt. Thank you again. All right, let's go find an earth hammer. Urban planner doesn't mess. <laughs> Wouldn't doubt it.
Huh? Sleepy. What's this thing? Oh, I was hoping the path might link thee up here. Hey, Sama! W wait up! Hey, Zen, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the igloo. Huh? Hmm? We're back in Ninewood Hills? You see, the gate here doesn't connect to just one the area. All throughout Grimoire, you'll find places. Save the locations that lead back here. Open the way to come and to go as you please. And how exactly do we do that? You already the song. Just walk up to the right place, and that's all it takes. But surely a means of transportation that handy must come with a catch? No, the catch! You can use the gate as the little or much as you like. What's more, time in here and time in Grimoire, they don't both the flow at the same speed. So whatever crisis is going to down, you can put it on hold and kick back here till you're ready. Wow, it's like magic! Yeah, really irresponsible magic. Just imagine revisiting oh, any boop. place we Whenever been. you get affiliate, Call it you need to have two emotes. One one emote is like a pointer finger, and another emote is a dog nose, just for your name. An H. <laughs> an H? But grades only go down to F. <laughs> extra, extra. Read all about it. What, what do you the one here, Seraphy? In case you're wondering, you can use the prism case anywhere you find one of these gates. Oh, I think I get it now. Gates are the what you meant when you talked about a strong connection. Huh? <laughs> oh, right, right. That's the gist of it. Okay, to the Nether Nebula. Does that heal you? Yes, it does. I, sh I need to get themed emotes. Chapter 3 Old Acquaintances. <laughs> she said the Nether Nebula is somewhere northeast of Cornelia, right? Time to go hustle and rustle a little Mirage muscle. Just don't hustle so much that you get yourself lost, okay? I might just leave you there. <laughs> When's the last time I got. Don't push it. Okay. Wow, the air here is so clean. Yeah, right? Yeah! <laughs> Could have used it the other night when she was playing uh, that mission with Salim. <laughs> Let's not mess around in the never neba thing a nabob. Nether Nebula. Do you think you can do something about that habit of forgetting the name of virtually everything? Actually, she have a she should have a map emote and on the map it says Where do I go? <laughs> oh, here's another gate. That's the right. Gates, they usually turn up in towns or at the start of most mirage-infested areas. You never have to travel far to the visit a place you've been. Whenever you want to get from point the A to point the B, just use the gate as a handy little shortcut. A shortcut, huh? So, like, if we wanted to go back to Cornelia right this instant, we could just take this gate back to Ninewood Hills, then we can take the gate from there to Cornelia. 
You see? All in all, it makes for a pretty short shortcut. Yeah! If it were hair, you'd have to call it... You'd have to call it a buzz cut! Okay. <laughs> Oh, for fuck's sake. Libra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I turned tutorials off, that'd be nice. Man, I. Yeah, we got this. I guess we're doing this. I don't know if it was annoying. Oh shit, no. Damn it. Alright. We're gonna attack the mini golem. And then we're gonna imprison the mini golem. And by doing that, it should make the other one capturable. No? Okay. There you go. Way to kill it. Good job. Yay. Come on, sis. Let's follow this rabbit hole as far as it goes. Yeah, fine. Just behave yourself. Yeah, fine. Just behave yourself. Very sad. And take your time, boo. Surprise! Opportunity knocks. Hey. Oh, failed. Failed. There we go. Yeah. Alright, take it easy, Zen. Thanks for stopping by and thank you for the follow. Mandragora. This dungeon is way more dungeony than I thought. Way more dungeon. Did you know that originally dungeon referred to the biggest tower in a castle? It's what they called the castle keep. How long has it been since I've heard Rain go off on one of her educational rants? She must be pretty upset. The so why is that? <laughs> Holy Jesus. For fuck's sake.
sans doute. Wasn't so bad. The more upset she gets, the more she tries to cover it up by stop. You know where the word trivia comes from? Sis, I think we're good. How do you have more defense with two items than fix or not leveled up? Gimme, gimme. Mirages can stack too? Yep, you're not the only ones who get way the stronger when you're piled up. Do their abilities change when they're stacked too then? Afraid to say. Nice knowing ya. Which means somebody needs to stop underestimating the enemy before he finds himself up to the ground. Okay. At least he knows the warning's meant for him. This is it!
What's this for? It's a strange switch that the response to mirages. The mirages you imprisoned the inside these caves should be able to help you out. Wait, fire or greater, earth resistance 50 or greater. Out that switchcraft. Yep. Now we know switch way to the go. Switchever one of you thinks you're being clever is about to get a knuckle sand switch. Ugh. Did did I just get owned? I'm the raising the white flag here too. <laughs> uh. Tama, weird question. Um, how come all this really useful, well-presented information keeps popping into our heads? Oh, that? I guess in a crow's the trying to give you some tips. Dude, really? I hate to the break it to you, but you will never the be that person. I know. It's so sad. Whoa, hey now, come on. You don't have to look that brokenhearted when you say it. Oh, uh, what's this? Oh, that's not the good. This is the call to threshold. Mirage is the create them to mark their territory. When you see a threshold, you better watch out because the mirages inside are extremely the powerful. And the worst part, if you cross it and lose a fight the inside, I can't use my powers to rewind time and extricate you. No extrication? Guess we'd better be extra careful then. <laughs> <sighs> anyway, it sounds like if we're going in, we better go in fully prepared. That's the for sure. 
And don't forget to save your progress, too. Yeah, curved. What the honk? Uh. Be careful. I expected some foolhardy adventurer with a terminal case of curiosity. Rama. What's this? Well, look who's back. Ah, the half finds. Hail and well met. Wait, hail and well met? That's not our names! I think he just means hello. Oh, and for the record, he happens to be a half-wit and a half-pint. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. Huh? What's so funny? Oh, you're having a lawn moment. Guess I'll just add this one to the pile. Wait, what pile? There's a pile? Apparently, we've met the three of you before, although we don't remember it. You do not remember us? Really? No wonder they haven't summoned us. Then our course of action is clear. We must ensure the pecking order is pecking in the right order. If you seek to command the three of us again, then demonstrate your strength now or else be destroyed! Die! Hold now! Why must you two always let the blood rush to your head? W uh, what do you mean? Would you just look at them? These are not the Mirage Keepers we knew. Hi. You're right. They do look rather... How do I put it? Put what? Mon does set the bar low. Like Limbo the bar low. Hmm? Ah, I see. See what? Very well. What say we pit them against just one of us to keep things nice and fair? Hmm. Agreed then. Go on. Choose from among us and choose wisely. Choose for what? Time certainly has not made you any more clever. What we're trying to say is the two of you are no match for all three of us at once. Which means... Right. I get it. Thanks. Now... Let's see. Huh? Wait, get what? Oh, I could use Foxfire against Shiva. I could use the Earth against Rama. Twould be foolhardy to challenge me. My judgment bolt strikes with such force it would shatter your very soul. Watch it. For an old guy, he looks pretty tough. Dude, tough doesn't even begin to describe it. Be the careful. Remember, we're still the inside their threshold. See how you like this. 
You're done! Predictable. I made the right choice, I guess. Ooh, three Arma gems. Enough. I have seen my fill for one day. That was fun for what it was. A shame the two of you have so much growing up to do. Quiet, you! I'm a Hulk waiting to happen. So long, we shall meet again. Well, our paths may cross before you know it. Bye-bye for now. Did I get my frits? Huh? What's this? A prismarium, duh. I know it's a prismarium, dummy. You didn't manage to imprison those tough mirages, but it looks though like they give you this prismarium from the same tribe as a consolation prize. I see. I guess we made the grade then. Zat. Tell his name was Fritz. The mirages of the nebula have been set free. And once again, time resumes its march. Well, we better make our way back to Cornelia before the Baja Mushins get any funny ideas. We gotta go all the way back. You can head to Ninewood Hills right then now if you want to. Huh? Now that the boss has been the bested, I can make you an exit gate right the here and now. Ta -da -da! It'll take you the back to Ninewood Hills, and from there, Cornelia's easy. Thanks to the buzz cut. I remember. <gasps> you don't get shortcuts much the shorter than a buzz cut. Wait! Unless you buzz the buzz cut, and then the what have you got? Uh, I think at that point... You call it a bald cut. Ninewood Hills whenever you want to rest up and the recover HP. While we're there, we should stop by Chocolates and stock up on items. Hey, you got it. I don't got much money to go to Chocolinos. But we could, uh... How many points do I have? So 
always good to have cure. Mini Vivi. Three. Leaf dagger. Three. 